Yeah, good afternoon everyone. And this is a case of Usher's syndrome, which is a case of uh, retinitis pigmentosa associated with severe bilateral sensory neural hearing loss. A 36-year-old female born to a non-consanguineous couple came to our OPD with a history of diminished vision in both eyes more at night since 15 years. The history of presenting illness was it was insidious in onset and gradually progressive and painless in nature. And also, she is associated with difficulty in hearing for over uh, last 10 years. There is no significant family history uh, except for the younger brother with similar complaints uh, of difficulty in hearing since 8 years and diminution of vision since uh, 8 years. On clinical examination, the uncorrected visual acuity is 6 by 16 in both eyes and best corrected being 636 in right eye and 6, uh, 624 in the left eye. And these are the ophthalmic, uh, ophthalmoscopic findings. There's pallor of optic disc, thread-like arteriolar attenuation with bony spicules uh, of retinal pigmentation in the mid-periphery, which is a characteristic of retinitis pigmentosa. And an ENT consultation was done and the audiometry showed a moderate to severe sensory neural deafness in both the ears. Usher syndrome is a heterogeneous autosomal recessive genetic disorder uh, uh, which is associated with visual impairment due to retinitis pigmentosa and hearing loss. It's also called Hallgren syndrome and it is, a, it is a disorder that permanently and severely affects the senses of hearing, vision and balance. It is mainly of three clinical types. Depending upon the severity of the uh, severity and the chron chronologicity, it is divided into type 1, type 2 and type 3. Type 1 and type 2 being more common. Type 1 with uh, profound hearing loss, a uh, loss of night vision by age uh, by 10 years and balance problems and uh, type 2 people having moderate to severe hearing loss in early childhood, loss of night vision by teenage and norm with normal balance and type 3 normal hearing at birth while hearing loss starts in the childhood and loss of night vision by teenage and uh, uh, normal with normal balance. Treatment for vision problems, there is no cure for uh, Usher syndrome. Low, low vision aids and vision rehabilitation can help people with Usher syndrome and vitamin A supplements can uh, uh, delay the progress of uh, retinitis pigmentosa and the hearing problems can be treated as such. Hearing aids or assistive listening devices can be used and cochlear implants can be used. At a glance, Usher syndrome, early symptoms include hearing or uh, hearing loss or deafness. Late symptoms include loss of night vision and uh, peripheral vision. Diagnosis depending upon the di dilated eye examination, hearing test, balance test and genetic test. Treatment includes vision aids, vision rehabilitation, hearing aids or cochlear implants. 